I would say that my superpower is patience. My superpower is my mindset. My superpower is uh, my discipline. My superpower is creativity. Man, we just wrapped up the Cool to Be S'more South Bend Initiative right here at Brown Middle. We had four different high schools from the South Bend area here, over 100 students. We had the opportunity to deliver our amazing documentary, docuseries, episode one, Homewood Bound, and a screening, a private screening, just for these amazing students. And then we had the ability to roll right over into a HBCU panel to really, really let all the students know the importance and the value of a smart mind, education, entertainment, edutainment, and we had to let them know that it's cool to be smart. And before they left out of here, each and every one of these students said, smart is now the new cool. <laughs> Today's event was amazing. Um, working with kids all my career, I think it's important for them to be able to see themselves and the people who are providing support to them. So I'll say being your authentic self is not an invitation to you being your unprofessional self. So seeing all of the kids in the room and the energy in the room, it wasn't um, people, they were, everyone was relatable. And so we were coming to them from that perspective of, who they are as young people today, not back in when we were in school. And so that created a lot of good energy and I feel like that created an opportunity for them to want to be more engaged. Today's event was amazing. Um, not only did it represent who we are as a culture, but also representing the unification where we come from. It represent um, our HBCUs, which our kids are definitely need to know more of. They need to know that there are resources out there for them. and. They also need to know that they have opportunities and resources that are right here within their city. We need HBCUs because it is so important that when you wake up in the morning, you know that you're not alone, that you know that there are people who look like you, sound like you, dress like you, and move like you who are doing great things in great places. It means so much, um, you know, personally for me and the staff here at the building, this is, this is what we show up to work every day for, you know, to host events like this, to give our students access to information like this. When I went to school here in South Bend, I didn't really hear too much about HBCU. So to have an event like this that's opening up our students' mind to the possibilities of what's out there for them and to be able to see people like them, uh, you can't really put a price on it. So my daughter, um, she's at Gremlin State University now. And one of the things she told me was my she said, I'm so happy to have teachers, teachers that look like me. I'm, I'm just so impressed with everything. Like this was, this was absolutely beautiful for this community. So to see all of these kids here interested, engaged, wanting to know more about the people that are in front of them, that's a generation or two before them. It's just incredible to see all of this come together on such a large but small scale to see all of the babies here. It was just beautiful. South Bend, we love you. We will be back. And let's make it do what it do.